having a 14-year-old win at the NCSA Junior Nationals, and we're going to see how the guys do, how they respond. This is the E final now, men's 200 backstroke. Swimming in this E final, in lane number one is Will Cumberland from Nation's Capital. In lane two is Daniel Wisenat from Germantown Center Swim Team. Three is William County from Marlins of Raleigh. Four, Jackson Higgins from Dayton Raiders. Five, Scott Piper from Academy Bullets. Six, Cody Bollinger from Poseidon Swimming. Seven, Matthew McDonald, Cincinnati Marlins. In lane eight, Connor Blanford from Marlins of Raleigh. We had an official walk by here with their hand raised. After the start, it looks like maybe uh, someone kicked beyond 15 meters. That's the maximum amount allowed underwater off each wall, including the start. Not sure who it was. They all look pretty close to 15 meters. So at the 100, we've got a 101.38 for Will County. It's pretty bunched up there. Again, 200-yard backstroke and 200-meter backstroke, two very different events. If you're not a good underwater swimmer, maybe the long course 200 backstroke is better for you than the short course. And now we got a new leader in lane number five. That's Scott Piper from Academy Bullets. That was a big turn for him. He was, he was about a half body length ahead at the 150. He just blasted off that wall. And it is Scott Piper, 205.55. So again, I'm not sure who was disqualified or if there was actually an official disqualification.